Yeah, that was uh, that fade away there. Definitely helping a little bit there. As we know, back there, not really a kill move. But catches him on a jump with that dare. This is a bad position. He's going to have to take a free 37. Of course, he wasn't in a spot to still keep going. Right. But it's still, he's keeping the damage up right now. And he's not giving up stage control. Oh, my goodness. <gasps> Does he get it? He gets the extra. He the that was so clean. Oh, <laughs> that's my top player. He did it on purpose. <laughs> I mean, Jackal has him at 171, but it almost feels like Jackal's playing a little bit scared to try, try to approach. Granted, it's still Fox. If you right, make a mistake, right. you're getting dash attack for it. And it's actually, yeah, this is exactly why you have to be so careful. <laughs> oh my goodness, there it is. Okay, you got that situation, not going to let uh, too much damage rack up on him. You know, you usually see it's some pretty good stuff off of uh, down throw the neutral air, but I think that fastball is going to allow Light to get out pretty early. But, oh, hold that jab, push him off the stage. Good stuff. I love the fight back there from Kaleo, but gonna be stuck on his platform. You're definitely eating all the uppers oh, in the world. Oh, and just like like not sticking too close to the ledge because he knows the game and watches so many mix-ups there, and you don't want to let him get a reversal at zero, take you off stage with things like those nears. You wait for him to get back on stage, and then these kinds of things start happening. Great evasion by Light and the disadvantage too. Even with a character like Fox, Ooh. not a lot of aerial drift to him, and not able to finish out the stop. A lot of these matchups, Fox is you know he fights Tilde all the time. It's Falco, it's a different character, yeah. but he knows how to deal with. Space spaces into a few ways. People talk about the spaces and we feel like, oh, they absolutely trash we fit. But you see how John Numbers fares against these characters, it, he's fine. He makes it look like it's not that bad. So honestly, I'm excited to see how he holds up here against a player like Light. It's interesting, right? Because you would think that num Numbers just has uh, no more stock. Too, starting on small battlefield, challenging that deep breathing immediately. Light, you're that guy. You, you do what the entirety of New York City has wanted to do for years, challenging deep breathing. That's the go. When you got speed like foxes and bravery like lights, you can do just about anything. Quick 96 and Ooh. you're gone. <laughs> like, I know oh, it's town, damage. but like, should fox back here really be killing it like 110 there? Yeah, I mean, depending on the rage and how fresh it is. But wow. Oh my, my goodness. Out of field, ready to go. Good pressure from light, great damage, rapid jab in the corner. Love that stuff from light. Keeping up the pressure real quick. You hear the crowd going in the back. We got some good smash play in the back here. The rapid jab by the platform. That's a good amount of damage already at 89%. Saying. So I'm saying right at the ledge, you keep all your other moves very fresh, using that rapid jab to rack up the damage. It's just good opportunity, too. It just knows that you're, you know, oh, that's going to be oh. a jab lock on the map. Got to make sure. Extra sure out here, too. And it's the immediate retaliation like we saw in the last game, too. Banana forcing light off the ledge. I like to cook medium rare. Some damage. Ooh. Oh! Oh! oh. oh. No. no way! More like anger, fury. You can you can see it. Oh! Oh! No! Oh, no! Like, okay. Yo, and whoa, if he double shine him, it was about to be. In, in, and honestly, if he got the shine out, that might have been just a straight up a stop. Yeah. He double shine. That hit the or stage, or yeah. like get a down smash or something. Man, oh. look at this light cooking. Even though not getting the stock, look at the number on the screen. 93. That's a lot of damage. Absolutely. I mean, this is definitely starting to threaten this up smash right here. He's easily threatened to up smash if he if he's able to find it. That cloud is getting sent. That was about uh -oh, to be right no there. Oh, the Connor, like, that's just amazing. Oh, <laughs> okay. Okay, good shield damage there. Baiting over the ledge. It's going to be a big interaction here. A couple up airs. It's going to be 70 damage already on Sephiroth. Racking it up. Wing is out, though. This is when the matchup really starts, right? Oh, my. Okay, like. <laughs> oh, my God. Dropping shield at a little too early. Nonetheless, Dark Wizzy going to go ahead and get that up smash. Mm -hmm. Got Shaq here. Forward air, too. A lot of pressure on the court. Oh, you, dude, could he have up smash off of that, Chuck? Uh, it, it's hard. So when you get that shine and you cancel, you can Not only... to put you on the spot, but I thought you might know. No, I, I don't think you, you can't combo in that right, cool. smash. So you, you can only that? Smash. shine. Smart combo off that, but it's just light is so quick that I feel like Ona's not... Maybe it's... Ooh, there it is. Back on PS2 in game two, Ob McBob trying to take it a little bit slower so far. Yeah, it just feels so bad. Like, after that first stock kind of fell in a unfortunate way where Cloud Bob missed his confirm, thanks right. to Fox being a fast faller. Like, the, the floodgates open from there, and they are the... See if Bob McBob can take another one for the crowd to bring the house down. Oh, what the heck was that? Uh, he started up hero spin, uh, but it clashed because Fox is uh, very safe on shield. Gotcha. The frame data on this uh, on this anthropomorphic of Fox pilot has goes dummy. Yeah. Oh my God. Speaking of what the heck, the back air clanking and the shine spike. Yeah, light. a little bit higher. Doesn't matter anyway. Mm -hmm. I, Ouch really has to prio being Ooh. center because he is losing in these offstage exchanges. Yeah. I feel like also Light just getting more damage off his starters and. Ouch is by like a good mile. Like Ouch gets the opening, it's like 30 damage. Like it's something that's minimal. Oh my or god. Dead. Okay, land on the platform. Uh -oh. oh, not gonna get up air strings. Still gonna do this amount of damage. And Sonic's gonna get out of there. Up 
there. Yeah, Sonic's kind of hurting here on the stock, getting caught out of that spin dash this time. Like, oh, oh my! Lead perfectly into that F smash. Right, Joshua then spacing it a little lower might not have been in the same situation to die there, but this time he just can't even get back down. Light's calling him out, trying to land at the edge of these platforms underneath them and catching these landings and putting Rob back in the air. He does have that those burners to get away, but eventually he runs out of fuel, and once he does, he's just a big body who just can't get down. I, I mean, speaking of big bodies that just can't get down, eating multitudes of up air. My goodness, Light, let him live. Let him breathe for a moment. First up air, second into the drag down forward air, up till the combo just keeps going. Ritual oh, no. going for, for the, the F smash. smash? No Dude, way. He was, he was trying to get the clip and the shine to boo. He's going for the fire fox. Oh my into the God. It is coming down to the wire. Hell of a oh. game three right now, but Light starting to pick up some steam. 86% oh, oh, oh. making 95. Hey, Can you touch the ground? Just a slight bit of patience right now. Yep. From light actually got him so much more damage. Like, I mean, he know he, he knew he wanted those up airs, but he's like, you know what? I think you up think air. I'm gonna yeah, 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 yeah. 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 There, no. There we go. Game number two, right back to battlefield, and the hits keep on coming. A couple of jabs right there to break up some pressure. Light putting him down. Does a good job disengaging nice. off the ledge. Yeah, just to get Louis to press a button and punish accordingly. Dash attack there, beating out the aerial. Luis. Oh, nice Ooh. idea with the Firefox. I like that. Palu very vulnerable when she's teleporting a ledge like that, but the up smash, get out of the sky. Fox still is at that like weight where it is really good for Toon Link in terms of the percent ranges. Oh, I love I love the confidence. I love it. But because of it, you're gonna take quite a bit of damage here as Light just gets several up tilts in a dash attack. Oh, no. Did he get the footstool down there? He didn't get the timing though to negate the curse. Okay, it's only grab answer from Light. I'm not trying to take too many risks here. I, up tilt's gonna be a lot though. Man, I'm the 30%. Oh boy, Tweak is not. My Tweak, Tweak is not teching right now. Like, <laughs> the techs are not out. The is gonna be able to buy himself a little uh, space though because of the orbs. Got two on him now. Gotta watch himself. Oh my oh, lord, called him. You know him. what? Just used to having or having that stale back here in that situation, but Light keeping it fresh and was able to get the KO at around like 130-ish after the hit with a little bit of rage as well. So now Light able to tack oh up the damage in all these up airs, 81% here on Dark Wizzy. That was a good trade though. Get your feet back on the ground, try to get something started. Air dodging back to the ledge. Light, his turn to talk here. He's working on uh, taking Ooh. the second stock already. Uh-oh. Fair, not getting the perfect punish right there though, Chuck. Calling out the jobs, not gonna get the trap, and wow. Still has light now on the stage, but sometimes I feel like a lot of players do this. They know exactly what to hit, but they throw it out either a little bit too early or they throw it out too late. Josh then now getting a little bit too antsy for the KO2, which allows for light to punish. I mean, look at that.